Hey guys, I'm the Burke and I do things. And today I feel like the last person uploading their BoxyCharm this month. However, I am so excited for this month. Like probably the most excited I've been so far. So I think most people watching this might already know what's in this box and it's more like which variety did I get as far as I think the lip color is maybe what's going to be different between everybody. So if you wanna see what came in my boxy charm, then keep on watching. Let's go. Okay, so if you do not know what BoxyCharm is, it is a $21 box a month. However, I sign up in three month increments, which makes it like $19, I think, a month. And this month's theme is Caribbean Queen. Okay, so we can kind of go through and see what we got. So the first item I'm very excited about, these are three face brushes from Luxie Brush. This trio would normally sell for $42, which is crazy, but Oh, they feel so nice too. So we have the 522 Tapered Highlighting Brush. I actually would probably more set this for powder. Then we have the Precision Foundation Brush. I don't really see a big difference between these two. They seem kind of similar. Maybe this one's a little bit fluffier, but I don't really like using brushes for foundation anyway. And then this is the 516 Duo Fiber Brush. Interesting. I'm not really sure what I'd use these for, but uh, actually I could maybe contour with this one because of the way it's shaped. Regardless, we will be trying them out together. Next is pretty cool. These are from the brand Baddington Lashes, and wow. These are like my first ever pair of like legit lashes that aren't a dollar or like drugstore brand. They feel like so nice. So these are silk lashes and these cost $28. So I will treat them like the treasures that they are and save them for a very special occasion that I don't know what that is because I don't do anything special. Next is something I'm so excited about because I've always wanted to try this just because everyone says it smells good and I've never smelled it so I'm going to smell it now and you can see my smell reaction live and in person. But this is a, I believe, travel size of the Sol de Janeiro Brazilian Bum Bum Cream. And everyone just talks about how good this smells, so like, I feel like I've really overhyped the smell and I'm ready to smell it. I got it on my nose. <laughs> it smells like cupcakes. Yep, that smells really good. And I will also treasure this because this travel size is $10 little teeny tiny guy of body lotion. Next is something I'm very excited about and the reason I am so excited about this is because Kathleen Lights has been talking about the um, Alamar um, and here is what it looks like. Oh I love that it folds back but these are the colors and I've been really excited about this because Kathleen Lights was talking about how amazing the quality of this is and she kept talking about her friend Gabby, her friend Gabby and then she kept showing pictures of Gabby and I was like I feel like I know Gabby. Gabby looks so familiar. And I put two and two together. And I'm like, wait, I know Gabby. Gabby is the girl who runs the Instagram stories for BoxyCharm. So she created her own line of cosmetics and she is doing the greatest thing ever, I think. She's a brand new makeup company and she's including like her very first makeup product in a BoxyCharm that she knows so many people get. And like, this is a way to easily get your name out there like if you really like her first product like you would be more likely to be interested in like anything else she comes out with down the line so I think she's a marketing genius and I'm really excited to test this out because any palette that has yellow and orange I'm sold on always okay next from Jante Blue I have a eyeliner in the shade charcoal and this is a $5 pencil, okay, and it's like a wooden pencil. I'm gonna swatch it. Obviously, I have just filmed my Ipsy video. I will swatch it next to the eyeliner I got in my Ipsy, just for comparison. Okay, so in Ipsy, the one I got is more of a brown, and this is more of like a deep gray. And I actually do not believe I have a gray eyeliner, so I don't really know what it will look like, but we'll try it out. And finally, I got an Ofra Long Lasting Liquid Lip in the shade Verona, and this would normally retail for $21. I actually only own one other Ofra lip product and I do like it. So I will swatch it next to my lip swatches from Ipsy. This is a really pretty like 
deeper mauvey brownish nude. Quite different than the color I got in my Ipsy bag. And yeah, I can't believe we got six full size items this month. I guess maybe because these two combined equal like $15, so putting like a travel size of this in made it possible to give us more items, which I'm not complaining about. I will take the travel 100%. I don't know if you saw my May unboxing, but I was saying how excited I was for the June box already because I already knew this palette was going to be in it. And I mean like, it's just so cool. It's so different. Like. I don't have a palette like this at all. It just looks so pretty and I just want to use it. So I will be filming that video ASAP and definitely stay tuned for it. But yeah, let me know. Do you guys subscribe to BoxyCharm? What was your favorite thing that you got this month? I mean, it's really hard to, to like narrow it down with everything, but 100% it's easily this. Like I've seen so many pictures of it online and it looked pretty online, but like in person. So cool and it's so cool that she was able to make a palette that was based on like her Cuban heritage oh yeah oh god I just stuck my finger right in the maroon shade oh look even on the back it says this is called the Rena del Caribe that is so bad I showed a palette volume one inspired by the beauty and rich culture of Cuba the birthplace of Alamar featuring eight intensely pigmented shadows ranging from delicate shimmers, high shine metallics, and velvety mattes. And this is cruelty free. So as usual, thanks for stopping by my channel. If you're new here, click the subscribe button and ring that bell for notifications. I have my Twitter, my Instagram, and my blog down below. Give them a follow and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.